I am Dr. Satish Nair, Professor and Senior Consultant, Head and Neck Onco Surgery of Apollo Cancer Center, Bangalore. Facial nerve is an important nerve which traverses through the ear and comes out of the face. It helps the movement of the one side of the face. The facial nerve is covered with some covered tissue on top. These tissues can develop into tumors or the Schwann cells that we say that. So these Schwann cells, when they develop a tumor, it's called a facial nerve schwannoma. Facial nerve schwannomas are rare tumors. They are present almost about 1% of the total tumors of the ear. As this nerve is traveling through the ear, through the various parts of the ear, a tumor or a facial nerve schwannoma in the ear can lead to various symptoms. It can lead to, first of all, paralysis of the nerve, which can cause one-sided facial weakness. It can also cause, if pressure onto other areas in the ear, hearing loss, which can be both conductive, depending on the, where the ossicles are involved, or it can cause sensory neural loss if the otic capsule or the inner ear is damaged. The typical treatment option for a facial nerve schwannoma is surgical removal. But then it depends on where it is. Most of the time, the facial nerve schwannomas arise from the inner part or close to the brain. Some of the very rarely can be involved the ear part or some others can be outside the ear too. For a tumor that is inside the ear, inside the temporal bone, as in this particular case, the surgical treatment is the first choice. Surgical excision of the facial nerve schwannoma can be performed or has been be performed conventionally from ages by an external approach which would involve an incision on the back of the ear exposing the complete ear drilling of the mastoid air cells drilling of the bone exposing the facial nerve removal of some of the ossicles and once the facial nerve is exposed then remove the tumor in this case we prefer to perform an endoscopic procedure as I have been performing in the last five to seven years major endoscopic ear surgeries including cholecystomas and tumors, we propose to perform this particular case by an endoscopic method in which the procedure is performed through the ear with an endoscope which does not involve any amount of bone drilling, doesn't involve dislocation or removal of the ossicles which are required for hearing and the whole thing could be visualized well and could be removed. So the advantage was that we could retain back the ear as it was before and also the hearing. Endoscopic transcanal excision of facial nerve schwannoma is the first time this procedure has been performed in the world and we are able to perform this surgery because of our expertise in endoscopic ear surgery, head and neck cancer surgery and also lateral skull based surgery. So it's an amalgam of all these three different features that have been brought together to perform this surgery by an endoscopic technique with reconstruction with good results.